quadratic formula. I've got a sheet for you to work on here. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Ms. You're welcome. I don't get this. This must be AP Calc BC. I got you. I got it. Negative B plus minus the square root of B squared minus 4AC all over 2A. you ever loved to grab so much you thought you'd got Check your answers over again. It seems the only way. Tell me all the equations now and I will solve it for you. Cause you are my Equations in my head like my hair getting done, baby. I need math like I need air in my lungs. I love it when I write on the board, yeah, we're young. B minus plus or minus, I'm done with it. Square root of B squared minus 4AC all over 2A. I be getting it. I be loving it. I don't want to check, but I got to check. I had a lot of right answers, but not none of them easy, not none of them easy. That for me, it sits right under the square root quadratic formula. My love, do you ever use the quadratic formula? You're the same, my plus minus sign. My of the B term, which is negative 5, plus or minus the square root of B squared, which is 25, minus 4 multiplied by the A term, the quadratic term, 3, and then multiplied to the constant, negative 8. And that's all over 2 times 3, which is 6. Once you have this problem, you multiply the negative 4 by these two terms. So that would be 12, and then 12 times negative 8, negative 12 times negative 8 would be positive 96. 
and 2 times 3, that would be 6. So negative 5 plus or minus square root 25 plus 96 all over 6. And negative 5 plus 9 square root of 25 plus 96 is 121. That is a perfect square. And 121 is a perfect square for 11. So it would be negative 5 plus 11 over 6. That would equal 6 over 6. That equals 1. And negative 5 minus 11 over 6. That would equal negative 16 over 6. And that equals negative 8 over 3. And uh, that's it. Great job. Does anyone have any questions? No. 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 Great. Work on your homework. <laughs>